you know. Yeah, precisely. Yeah, my leg is jumping out from under <laughs> Are we good? We are good. We are good. Okay, hi, I'm Trouble, and these guys are Heart Attack Shack. And first off, thank you guys so very much for coming out this morning. Ow! Absolutely phenomenal. I, oh my God, I love it. That was great, definitely. So, we will hunt. <laughs> After the show, there's time enough. <laughs> Remember, it's sunny out, so it's like you're supposed to like get all drunk and rain and then do the yeah. We gotta turn it up a little. Uh, do we? Or do I just need there to talk louder? There we go. All okay. right. It's okay because the last thing I said was burpee sex, so we probably boobies. Like, boobies. Uh, it's uh, not. We want that on there. We totally we rewind. Rewind. <laughs> <laughs> so tell us about the groupie sex. No, okay. So um, it, it always Sorry. goes downhill real quick with these shows. Just to let you know, professionalism. Yeah, no. Anyways, starting with you, introduce yourselves, please. Dan. <laughs> yeah, Hi. Jordan Hi, Dan. Hi, Dan. Hi, Dan. Cody Wayne. We figured that one out already. I'm Nick. And I'm Greg from the University of Vienna. <laughs> and a happy boy Dan. back here. I'm Rick. Slick Rick. I was waiting for I'm Rick and I'm an asshole. <laughs> No, no, and I don't know that personally. I think he totally rocks because he sang the song, so he got up. Not only did he wake up early enough on a Saturday morning, anybody who does this, I mean, I have to do it, and I'm amazed half the time. I mean, today is one of those mornings where it's like I'm not focusing well. So, anyways, how long have you guys been together? How did the band form? I'm totally handing you the mic. Don't look at me like it's here in that place. <laughs> I told you, whoever sits next to me gets it. I think uh, Dan and Nick been playing together about, what, 15, 20 years, something like that? 16, yeah. Yeah, they've been, they've been, they've been a while. They haven't been around. And, uh, it's true about knee high. Yeah. I think Greg joined the band maybe about a year ago, a year and a half ago, something like that. And uh, I just came in maybe four months. I'm, uh, I'm the new guy. And uh, Slick Rick's been hanging around the whole time, and he's just, he's just getting in on it. So. Very, very cool. And we'll go to you. Where are you guys going to be playing out? Are there any gigs scheduled? Is there like any way to reach you guys to like well, book you for gigs, stuff actually, like that? Actually, that's that's that, that's another question that we'll go right over to this man because he's our new PR guy. Oh, oh my God. Yes. <laughs> actually, I don't want to set this up, so this is all. Right. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, uh, we're Heart Attack Shag. You find us on Facebook. You find our contact information on Facebook. It's a uh, heart attack shack, so easy to find. And uh, we'll play just about anywhere. Do you have anything scheduled? Anytime. Uh, we're going to play the Doopy Cat show. I'm not sure the date. It's next yeah. month. Right. And we're excited about that. So, very cool. Um, you know, house parties, whatever. Very, very cool. <laughs> <laughs> He's like Silent Bob over here. He's the shy one. No, don't make me do it. Well, then, you know what? We'll, we'll ask him a question. So, how did you start playing music? How did you get into it? What are your influences? Stuff like that. Speak into the mic. Speak into the mic. <laughs> See, I yell when I'm not near, right? Speak into the microphone. Well, I just started playing when I was about 13 years old, um, neighborhood band, and um, you know, just continued to start playing. You know, just kept it going. You know, love the music, got to love it. You know, it's part were of your life. Influences? Um, Basically, the hair rock, that's what hair I started hair off with. Hair man! Hair man! Hair man! Hair man! But I love it. That's Slater. what I love to do. Play music. Same question to you. Uh, my, my daddy was a drummer, so I've been playing kind of my whole life. Daddy! And, uh, I'd say my, my major influence is gravity. Can't get away from that. So. Oh, sorry. <laughs> You know what? We don't even know Rick's influences, so let's pass it back here. Okay. I, want, I want to know as well. <laughs> you're admitting that you're like not saying anything. He's just like. Dude. I've always, I've always liked to sing. My mom always was a singing person, and uh, Heart Attack Shack just gave me a chance to get on stage and and throw that one song out. So it's been fun. It's been a a lot. Getting over the stage fright is probably my biggest thing, but you know, classic rock was the major influence in my mother, so. Very cool. 
Uh, we're going to talk about influences. Uh, I've been playing since I was about nine years old. And my main influence was Chuck Berry, of course, B.B. King, Johnny Shy, Robert Johnson, stuff like that, you know, and, and over the years, like I said, 15 years playing with this silent bob over here. You know, <laughs> we've uh, basically played every dive bar, not to say this is a dive or anything, but every freaking dive in this town, up and down, all the way around, man. And uh, with this, this cat right here, Gregory, man, he's got us all beat. You know, so. <laughs> He's, uh, well, isn't that a polite way to this, say this boy, this, boy, this boy just got back from Vegas here, so. Uh, why don't you tell us a little bit about that? <laughs> oh, no. uh, you know what happens in Vegas stays in Vegas. No, 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 no. We got called out here this morning, so you got, you got to give it a little peace here. Come on. Well, it was a hard ride home, let me tell you that. Uh, it always is. Uh, it was too short. It was only there two days. We played it up. House party, and uh, and I've been on a couple of football games and won those. And uh, oh, yeah. one of the oh. ladies got the, the Packers, Packers, and who they play? <laughs> Doesn't matter. They won. I just, I just bet on the over. I want that team. <laughs> so every time somebody scores a touchdown, it's it's great. You know, you don't care who scores. Um, <laughs> We had a good time, and uh, one of the ladies lost about a thousand bucks. It wouldn't matter if she would have won a thousand; she still would have had the same attitude. But um, these guys are, uh, uh, you know, the bass and the drummer tight. And if you have a band where the bass and drummer tight, that's the foundation. And uh, then we have Nick, so that's, that's it, you know. And Rick. Rick uh, did his uh, initial performance at The Rock last week, I believe, right, Rick? It was my first. Uh, 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 right. You know, screwed up for Rick. But we have a lot of fun, and it's 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 really great being with these young guys. You know, uh, after practice, uh, I gotta leave because <laughs> I can't hang. You know, so. <laughs> get a little carried away. Yeah. So, uh, but anyway, I'm I'm glad to be with these guys, and, and uh, it's a lot of fun. So. Awesome. Hey, don't let for you too great. Here's a ladies' man, and you know what, ladies, she, you know, Ow. single. So. Yeah. <laughs> Just putting that out there for you. What was Somewhere your Facebook page again? <laughs> 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 they both at the same time. <laughs> 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 you know, I mean, we're out here to promote everything. That's what the show is to promote. So, I mean, whether it's people or bands or whatever, we're all good. You know. All right. He's getting pink. It's cute. Look at him. Look at him. Are they cute? I, I'm single too, by the way. I forgot about and you. And he's cute. He's like a little puppy. I didn't say that. Hey, tell, tell him about your challenge. Oh, okay. Yeah, here we go again. Thank you, Duke. We have two things that we have to, like, prop to. Um, first off, Duke decided that I needed a theme song, which I think is totally cool. I want a theme song now. So we're putting it out to all the bands out there. I'm putting it out to Please Be Nice because Izzy sang that song about me and it was horrifying but true, which we don't want really. We can lie and say I'm really sweet and innocent. That would work really well. Um, you know, so if you have some ideas on some words to say, and they're nice and printable, even though most of my life isn't, um, feel free, send it to me, send it to Duke, Duke and Cat, wherever, and um, don't put it out there before we see it. Please, I'm nice. I really am. Please. And so, I know, seriously, the song he sang about me, holy <clears throat> So anyways, we love The River's Edge. This is the second thing I need to promo. We absolutely love The River's Edge. They put up with me every Saturday morning, which, I mean, seriously, I should pay them for that. And they have some really great things. Tonight, Benjamin Hyatt is playing. You want to come out and see them. They absolutely rock. It's my girl Angel, wherever the hell she went. It's her birthday, so we're all going to be here partying. So there's going to be booze, boobies, and total debauchery. Yes. Yeah, it's going to be all about jello shots and boobies tonight. So, and Benjamin Hyatt. Boobies, Benjamin, booze, yay. Right? Right. Right? right. Three Bs. Life rocks. So, you want to come out tonight for Benjamin Hyatt. You want to come out on Wednesday nights. They have the poster girl search. 
So they have hot girls like totally parading around to try to win $50. In February, they're going to have the finals, all the girls who won each week, and that girls could be the poster girl for the River's Edge. And I don't know if you saw last year's, but Amber, serious, or Aaron, seriously? Shit. Totally. Yeah, but anyways, love you. Um, so you want to come out on Wednesday nights for that. Thursday nights, the beer pong table is pulled out. They play beer pong, and at midnight, the pole dancing starts. Seriously, do you not want to come to this bar? It's, you know, Friday nights country, Saturday nights rock, and boobies most every night. Hottest bartenders in town. Totally giving Amber props. We love you. Yay! Hottest bartenders in town. Always a good time here. And last but not least, Heart Attack Shack on Facebook. Do you guys have, like, Reverb Nation or any of that going? You can listen to our songs on Reverb Nation. There's a couple you can download for free also if you'd like. Very cool. And is that under Heart Attack Shack too? And if they go to your Facebook page and like it, I'm sure all the information is there for it. So you definitely want to do that. I'm going to be posting clips on my YouTube channel, which is Trouble and AZ1. And so you'll be able to see the first set, the interview, and the second set there. Um, we'll also have it on Duke and Cap. We'll also post it on your band page. So you guys can, like, you know, cut it up, do whatever you want with it, and, and promo the heck out of it. And tell them we switched it from Mondays to Tuesdays. Yes, and we now, because... We'll blame technical, technical difficulties. Technical difficulties. Yeah, technical difficulties, not the inability of Treble to like get her shit together at all. At all. At, at all. At all. Sometimes I just need to go home, but yeah. Yeah, no. Um, anyways, technical difficulties. We will be re-airing the show in its entirety on DukeAndCat.com Tuesday nights at 7 p.m. Courtesy of Electric Tiger Productions. Electric Tiger Productions. Jonathan Z. That's right. See, I've shortened the last name, even though I know the whole thing. I'm just like, Z. It sounds totally cool, doesn't it? Yeah. Totally. And I'm being nice to him, even though he, like, yeah, get this. He films my boobs for like three minutes because he's doing a mic check. Yeah, right. See? So, I mean, if that doesn't give you another reason to tell me, like, See that bus? You just got thrown under it. <laughs> Anyways, I want to thank you guys again. I really, really appreciate you guys coming out and playing. You guys are going to hit the stage again and play another set? Excellent. Looking forward to it. And I will come back. Thank you.